Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jensine or Jungle Naps, whichever one you want to call me, all good with me. If you're new to my channel and you like favorites videos and beauty reviews and sometimes tutorials, then go ahead and subscribe. I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So you guys already know we're going to be talking about some favorites today and even though this is April favorites honestly these are just things that I've been loving currently not necessarily just in the month of April some of them are a bit more recent but I feel like I've got a good little smorgasbord of things to talk about <laughs> uh, we got some hair we got some makeup we got some skincare so girl get you a little bit of a snack and uh, yeah let's go ahead and get started give this a thumbs up if uh, you're interested to see what I'm going to be talking about okay so if you guys didn't know I do wear wigs this wig is my very first one that I made sometimes I refer to her as Sasha uh, I love this wig it's awesome and when I wear lace front wigs I love using this uh, got to be glue blasting free spray obviously this is not something new I'm like super late to the game but I was looking for something to help kind of you know lay down the laced front part and I found this spray I got it at Target it was really really cheap and you get like 12 fluid ounces it's from um, Schwarzkopf and got to be like that those two brands and let me tell you, when we're talking about it lays it down, it lays it down. Like, yo wig ain't going nowhere, no how, okay? I mean, if you do it right, you know what I mean? So what I do is I'll usually like spray this on my hairline, take my finger, kind of, you know, move it around, make sure it's equally distributed, and then I get a blow dryer, and on the cool setting, what I'll do is I'll just, you know, lay it down, hold it, and then I'll like, you know, blast it in there so that it dries quickly and it's so easy to remove all you do sometimes I use a spray bottle put some water on there rub it on and then it just comes off really really easily but I'm so surprised just how amazing it just lays down that wig like good lord so I definitely if you guys are looking for something like this I super suggest it because it's really cheap you can get it at Target everywhere basically and uh, it does the job okay so next up in the hair department this is more for natural hair I stopped by the uh, TJ Maxx in my area and I was just kind of you know checking out the products sometimes they got some really good products like those Shea Moisture products they be going on sale and uh, this is a brand uh, called Alafia and this is their beautiful curls enhancing leave-in conditioner now it's usually seven dollars I got this on sale for five dollars don't let on the side it says wavy to curly don't let that fool you it definitely works for 4c natural hair and let me tell you guys when I put this in my hair my hair smells so good for like two days afterwards um, it just smells like really tropical and I believe it also has a certified fair trade shea butter in it so if you love shea butter on your hair it's really really amazing for that and it also has coconut oil yarrow and uh, chamomile and those last two help soothe your scalp so if you get scalp irritations this is also really amazing I can't say enough Good things about this it's definitely made itself into my favorite leave-in category which I have a lot of hair products I'm almost embarrassed to show you guys how much I have <laughs> but this is definitely worth it and it's affordable so if you live in the States check your TJ Maxx see if they have that brand so we've got one more hair product this is from UB natural botanical curl perfect forming mousse now they sent me a whole bunch of products like maybe actually it was a long time ago I want to say maybe like four to six months ago and I mean 
I have 4C hair, so I'm not trying to use no curly mousse on it, but I do use this for my wigs that have curlier hair. Like, I use this in this wig all the time, gets rid of any frizz, just really, like, bunches up the curls or the waves so nicely, and it's not, like, super sticky, you know what I mean? It's just, it still dries and, like, feels like hair. So if you have a looser curl pattern or you have wigs that have human hair and they're a little bit curlier or wavier, definitely try this one out. Okay, so on to skincare. I just have two skincare products for you guys. I love trying new skincare and I feel like that also benefits you guys because that way, you know, you can just discover, hey, you know, whether something's worth your coin or not. Now this is the Pacifica Sea Change Future, Future Youth Serum and it has concentrated floral cells and it's supposed to lift and replenish. I don't really know about the lift and replenish part but when I read the back it says that it firms, lifts, hydrates and brightens skin with potent native floral cells and marine extracts. Now I recently ran out of my Derma E youth serum which had like antioxidants and really good stuff to just prevent any free radical damage and just help you know to aid gracefully I'm all into like anti-aging skincare and this had that same kind of ingredient list it had the marine extracts which is what I was looking for now it's not necessarily super affordable but I really like the brand Pacifica because they have a ton of really natural ingredients and because I have sensitive skin that's the route that I just tend to go with anything that's natural non-irritating it's a plus if it brightens if it hydrates if it has anti-aging all that jazz uh, so far my skin is loving this hasn't caused any breakouts and because my skin can be oily at times it just sinks into your skin and that way when you apply your moisturizer you know you're not like extra oily so I think this is going to be really great with, for people with normal to super oily skin next up in the skincare department Okay, you guys, you're not going to believe, like, the steal that I got on this. Now, as I said earlier, like, I'm a big fan of TJ Maxx. It speaks to my soul. I love getting good stuff for a discount. If I can avoid paying full price, like, I'm in, you know what I mean? And I recently got this uh, Tatcha Supple Moisture Rich Silk Cream Moisturizer, and when I tell you, this thing retails for, I believe it's around $150. And I saw it, I did like a double take when I saw this in TJ Maxx. And it was only for $50. Normally, I would not be purchasing a moisturizer for $50, but I knew that I was never going to get a chance to try this again, you know, at a discounted price. And when you open this up, it's just really well packaged. They give you like a little spoon thing so you can dip it in the cream and that way you don't have to dip your fingers in there and then they cover the cream and inside I don't know if you guys can really tell it's this it's like a water slash gel consistency normally I don't like gel creams or anything because they tend to make my skin a lot more oily than it really is but this thing I use it at nighttime you can use it in the daytime too but I prefer to use it at night and it just sinks into your skin and I love that because then when I go to bed I don't have a ton of product being like smeared on my pillowcase it just like sinks in and then it's amazing your skin doesn't get oily it somehow manages to control the oiliness so I don't know y'all if you get a chance to try that product whoo I have a feeling that you might not be disappointed at all. Okay, so now we're gonna move to makeup. I have three products that I wanna show you guys. Now this first product is what I'm wearing on my eyes right now. And I don't really know if you guys can actually see my eye makeup super up close, but I just decided that I wanted to experiment with things. And I've actually had this sitting in my makeup little area for a long time I bought it I used it once and then I was like oh, I don't know how I'm gonna incorporate this but for those times that you really want to experiment this is the butter London it's like a liquidy gloss kind of consistency and this is in the shade spark oh my gosh it just goes on your lid and it can look really like wet 
I love this. It, this is the actual golden halo that I have on my eyes, that color right now. It's so intense. You can use it as kind of like an experimental look, a pop of color. You can put all over your lid for when you really want to go all out. Um, and it's it has kind of like a custardy kind of consistency. Um, I love it. I think it's beautiful on any skin type. The only thing that I kind of want to suggest to you guys is basically if you have really dry eyelids, I think that this might highlight that texture. So just be careful. Yeah, it's an amazing, amazing pigment slash custard gel, whatever you call it. <laughs> so next up is, uh, you know, the lip category. Now, I heard about this brand, Models Own, so I stopped into Ulta recently and I was like, oh snap, it's supposed to be this drugstore slash affordable brand and they have everything from like primers to contour kits to eyeshadow palettes to lip products and after just kind of, you know, taking a little survey, checking things out. I was like, okay, I really want to try out their lip products because they have some really cool matte liquid lipsticks. And I recently checked this one out. This is the shade Berry Cool. And let me just swatch this for you guys on the back of my hand. It is so pretty. Um, I mean, come on, like how could you not love this color? And what I love about it, like for today, I've combined it with several lip products and it just plays so well with them. I'm so impressed. This is definitely gonna be in my like more of everyday kind of lip looks and it's so, so creamy, like super, super, super pigmented, you guys. I mean, it's not thin at all. So they did an amazing, amazing, amazing job. Definitely suggest that you go and swatch these liquid lipsticks in Ulta when you get the chance. So now I want to tell you guys about one of my favorite lip products. And you probably heard me talk about this and I'm sorry if I sound like a broken record. And it'll probably be in more favorites, but I cannot get over Anastasia Beverly Hills Sepia Lip Gloss. I mean, this thing, it just speaks to me. It's for a brown girl, it's great everyday wear. I mean, honestly, it probably looks good on all types of skin types, but I'm just saying for my skin tone, if you're looking for like a really good nude, this is like, is what it's all about really. And it's long lasting. It just doesn't come off like with nothing, you know what I mean? So if you guys can see that, it might look a little light, but I'm wearing this on top of Models Own, that color that I just showed you guys right now, and it just looks so pretty. And it looks pretty by itself. I always get compliments on this lip color. I just can't say enough. It's the truth. It's the truth. So now I want to talk about a non-beauty item, and <laughs> so I'm really into like kind of, you know, more hippie stuff, I don't know how to describe it. But basically, I really wanted to get a diffuser so that I could diffuse some essential oils in my home. And I sometimes actually work at home, so it's really nice to kind of create a less stressful environment for yourself. So, I went to TJ Maxx, my best friend, my other home, and I got this really cool looking diffuser. So it opens up and all you do is you put a little bit of water inside, you add a few drops of your essential oil and then you put it in a room wherever you are and it just pumps mist into it and it's not really loud. This specific brand is by a company called Pure Enrichment. It was kind of cheap. It was like, well not cheap cheap. It was like $24, $25 at TJ Maxx. And I like to put lemongrass essential oil in there because it's just really soothing. When you just walk into a room and it just smells really calming. You can put whatever you want in there, lavender, you know, anything really. It just really changes the vibe of a room in your house or if you in fact happen to work in an office space and they would allow you to use that, I highly suggest it. So that's my little hippie home tip. <laughs> if you're interested in that kind of stuff. Um, and definitely don't forget to check out my favorite playlist if you guys want to see some more of the products that I've been digging in the past. 
and I love you guys and let me know if you're interested in seeing a YouTube live video I've been thinking about doing something like that but I want your feedback so I love you guys and I will see you in the next video bye